Hey guys, and welcome back to another video. It's currently June 2nd, 2023. And as you can see, we are back down in the lovely home gym, AKA the dungeon, AKA the underground. I'm going to walk you guys through a little trap workout today. And yes, it's a full workout dedicated to traps. And that might sound a little odd to you guys, but the reality is, is that traps are essential for all of your main movements. That includes deadlift, bench, and squat. So you have to build strong traps. We bench on our traps. We need traps to deadlift. And of course we need traps to squat. So here's a little workout routine. I'll walk you guys through it. Completely dedicated to traps. So stay tuned. Hey guys, so our first exercise on this trap day is obviously shrugs. Love to start with shrugs. I start really light. I work my way up in weight, eventually getting to a heavy weight where I will complete two to three uh, heavy working sets. Rep range is anywhere between 10 to 15. <laughs> Shrugs are done. Next exercise is a upright row using a easy bar or S bar slash curl bar. I know the general idea of a upright row is to work on front delts slash shoulders. But if you tweak this movement just a little bit, you can hit basically all of the trap, both front and back. So, and the key to that is having a little bit closer grip and pulling it really high into your neck chin region and really squeezing traps at the top. Don't focus on the front delt or shoulder. The goal is to pull it somewhat high and squeeze your traps at the top. If you keep your head slightly bent forward in this position, um, it's just a little bit more uh, to help isolate the trap in this movement. So we'll complete five sets of this rep range is definitely close to 20 and above. So uh, five sets. Next exercise for your traps in this workout is a in the back uh, shrug. Love these. They're a little bit awkward. They're also really good to do or a lot easier to do. Maybe I should say on a Smith machine. These are essential to hit a different angle of the trap. Movement is more isolated to the back of the trap. Definitely a huge exercise to build the strength of your traps and to build your traps up. So All right, guys, 
we're still rocking and rolling. We are almost through the workout, so it's been great. I love these days. It took me some time to build up to this amount of work to such a specific muscle group. Over time, carryover is huge. So anyway, another movement, I like to call these uh, trap flies. It's somewhat of a reverse fly. Well, the key is, is to keep your movement higher rather than lower. So you'd have your re reverse fly would be here and our trap fly is gonna be here. If you see, it's focused on the trap here. I'd be more in my shoulder, here I'm in my trap, and here I'm in my back. So you wanna stay right about here. And you'll feel it as you start squeezing your traps. Again, this exercise can be very easily mistaken into other muscle groups, so it's essential uh, that you have that uh, mind-muscle connection in these and really emphasize on squeezing the trap. I'll do five sets. Rep range is definitely 20 or more, so. All right, guys, last exercise of the workout. And of course, some more shrug variations. This is a dumbbell shrug. Key here is to change the grip. So in a barbell shrug, or if you dumbbell shrug this way, you could be very easily out here. Dumbbell shrug somewhat force you to be to the side, which helps hit the outside of the trap. Five sets, rep range is 20, 20 plus. All right, guys, that wraps up this complete trap workout. It was good. Definitely give it a try. Start slow. Work yourself up to a full day of a, a full trap routine. I know it might sound crazy, but it is huge for your overall strength when it comes to all your main movements. So definitely uh, keep it in mind. But with that, we're done. And as always, like, share, and subscribe. I have so much more content coming. So definitely stay tuned for a lot more and this weekend and next week i definitely got a huge surprise for everybody so stay tuned and until next time keep rocking